You guys, we're back with Victorious. If you missed any of it, there's a link in the description to the playlist. Y'all want to check out this game. I think there's a lot of good drama. There's a strict grandma. I'm, I'm enjoying this game so far. All right, let's get to it. I still haven't watched the show. I'm sorry. I, maybe I'll do it tonight. I don't know. One day I will. One day I, I, I told you guys I would and I will. By the end of this game being over. Wait, has it really been that long since I last played? I'm sorry, guys. I will upload this a lot faster. I don't. Sometimes I just don't realize how fast time goes. Wait, I already did this shit. What is this? I already got this done. Oh, it didn't. Sh it didn't save because I didn't. I don't think I went to the next <laughs> level. But I thought I did. Maybe I did. Oh God. Why? Yeah. All right, I got through that in like record time. It took me three minutes. Now, I got, well, I guess I got to get through this. All right, Robbie the set designer. Let's see what Robbie's all about. Hey, Robbie. How are you and Rex coming along with the set? I'm almost finished. Actually, I'm trying to finish up the balcony set. Could you grab my hard hat for me? Sure, where is it? Uh, I forget. <laughs> it's either in the music room or my locker. No problem. I'll track it down for you. Well, Thanks, Tori. Go, Robbie. You'd think my hair would be enough protection, but it's not. Wow. <laughs> okay. Yo, what's up, Andre? Andre, I'm looking for Robbie's hard hat. Have you seen it? Sorry, Tori. I haven't seen it at all. It's definitely not in here. <gasps> Let's break into this locker. Wow, look, see? Robbie's locked with all of Robbie's things and hard hot. Hard hot. Hard hot, guys. Hard hat. Sorry. It's, oh, my man. Well, not my man. Jade's hey, man. Hey, back. No time to chat. I gotta put up this banner. Okay, later. Wait. Oh, Romeo and Julie? Who the fuck is Julie? No, I'm not going there. Oh my god, I was trying to click on Trina. Where now oh, we gotta go walk all the way back around to hear whatever idiotic thing Trina actually has to say. All those drinks have worn me out. I hear you're helping with the set now? Yep. Wanna help me out? Nah, I am all about making these drinks. Mm-hmm. All right, let's go give this shit to Robbie. Then we're gonna have to be someone else's servant for the day. I'm losing it. What was I looking for? Robbie's hat. Oh my, Robbie's hat. I'm losing it. Robbie's oh. hat. I'm losing it. Um, <laughs> I'm, lo I'm fucking losing it, please. <laughs> Please just work. Here's your hard hat, Robbie. Oh Try to be careful. Great. Thanks, Tori. Um, could you maybe grab me some paint now? Paint? Why didn't you tell me you needed paint when I went to get the hat? Right, this bitch. The dummy forgot. <laughs> uh, well, I didn't think of it before. What color of paint? Actually, I need gray, red, and blue. Oh, you need three paints. What? Why all these colors? Well, the set is actually a really cool shade, but... It isn't easy to match. Okay, paint it is. <sighs> Probably better like buy me lunch or something. Something seems off with that banner. Um, yeah, the spelling of Juliet. Not helping the play at all. Oh, uh, figures. Light bulb. Working on the play score, designing some outfits, finding some paint, mixing drinks, and maybe taking a break. Trina. Rex and I underage drinking Trina, really? No, it's not. It's not alcoholic. Don't worry, guys. Rex and I are hammering nails and painting some backdrops, mentally preparing for the big opening night. Get me out of the school forever. Maybe the janitor's closet will have some shit. <gasps> Look, a blue paint. Oh, that's not, but this I can go into. Tools and stuff. Am I looking for something? You're looking for paint! Tori, it's been a minute since someone told you to get paint. What is going on? Oh, there it is. There's some blue paint, or maybe it's not blue. Right but now, it's I need to focus on the light bulbs, and you're not a light bulb. 
How are you, cat? Sorry, Tori. I have to design these costumes. Right, fine. No one talk to me. All I want to do is talk about paint. All right, what do we have? What's that? Stone gray. The E makes it fancy. Oh. Oh, is that a paint? Yes, it is. <gasps> That's another. I'm like, I really like that they're right next to each other. Okay, let's go. Maybe I should check and make sure that those are the right color, but I'm, you know, given that we can grab it, I'm sure it's the right color. I'm sure. Oh, yeah, look. Red, blue. Gray. Stone gray. All right, I've got the paint. Okay, let me just mix this up and see what we've got here. A little more blue. Yeah, that's it. A touch of red. Voila. This better that be good. awesome, Robbie. I think it will definitely be noticeable. Was there anything else you needed? Dummy didn't want to bring it up, but we need a saw. Are you kidding me? Robbie, no sawing Rex in half. <laughs> it's for the balcony front, Tori. I need to cut it into shape. Just be careful not to try any magic on Rex this time. All right. Well, do you need anything else? I'm losing it. I need a saw to cut out the balcony. <laughs> I'm losing it. <gasps> All right. Oh, my God. All right, where have we not been? Have I been to the main hall? Oh, yeah, I have. I haven't been to Psychowitz's classroom, so maybe the saw is there. Yo, you got a saw? You need to make certain everyone is on task and preparing for the big open. Get to it, stage manager. You need to make certain- Okay, I am, but I need a fucking saw. <laughs> Is it gonna be in the janitor's room or closet somehow now? There was no saw here before. Unless I missed it. No, I didn't. Now it's gonna be in there. <gasps> That's right, because we weren't looking for a saw before, but we had look all right, it makes sense. I thought it was just gonna be laying out. Find that I didn't remember seeing a saw. What the F? Are you kidding me? I hope I don't get in trouble. I, I didn't do it. I'm losing it. What was that? I need a saw. I'm losing it. Oh, I see footprints. What is this? Robbie, I found the saw in the toolbox. Thanks, Tori. But we have a problem. What? What do you mean? What happened? Sinjin came by looking to work on the lights, but I told him I was busy in here. He spilled the red paint, so I sent him to get some more. Yeah, and he's making a mess all over. Without that paint, I can't finish the set. I put, why is this a problem? Sorry. Okay, well, I'll find him. It shouldn't be too hard with all the red footsteps. Thanks, Tori. I think he was heading to the art room. Oh my god, I hate everyone at this school. I hate everyone. Can't do anything for themselves. That's not even the music. That's not the art classroom. I can't even do anything either. Oh my god. Just lock us in Carrie style and burn us. <sighs> All right, what the heck, Ra or Sinjin? <sighs> Where is he? He's gonna walk around the whole school. Maybe he went to the janitor's closet. Oh God, he's gonna try and make out with us in there. Okay, good, he didn't come here. So that's not gonna happen. <sighs> Wait, there was more paint in there. Oh, there was, but you couldn't grab it. Pretty sure like the stone gray paint, or at least the can that looked really similar to it, was there. Oh. He was just in here tracking his red footprints all over. He kept mentioning the acting classroom. Okay. And the janitor is not gonna be happy about this. Ooh. Somehow I'm gonna have to clean it up. That better not happen. I will freak out. And why did I come back here? The art classroom. Where is he? Saw Sinjin heading to the music room. Tell him I need him to clean this mess up. I'd been there. He wasn't there. Ugh. He must have came after I left. Are you serious? What is this? I barely saw Sinjin when he came in here. He must be real worked up to be climbing up the walls like that. He was gonna talk to Beck. <laughs> Are you serious? 
Beck is in the main hall. I have no idea how he did this, Tori. No idea. I finally found some red paint, and he snatched it from me and headed to the art room. Has Sinjin gone crazy? What is this? This is too much. Oh my gosh. Cat's still in La La Land. Oh, hey Tori, how's it going? Sinjin, finally! I've been looking everywhere for you. Really? Weird, I've been around. Never mind. Robbie needs the red paint. Sure, right here. Hey, tell Robbie I need to get in there to work on my lights, would you? All right, is there even any red paint left? All right, asshole, here's your paint. I can't finish the set. <gasps> I didn't grab it. Hold on. Here you go. I finally found Sinjin. Here's some more red paint. That boy is just odd, Tori. Okay, let me see here. Voila. What do you think? Oh my god. Wow, nice. Yeah, I think it's pretty much wrapped up. All right, we're ready to stage a play here. Looks really good. All right, finish that level. Is this gonna be a Robbie one? It's probably just gonna repeat, but yeah, it's repeating. All right, Robbie, I am ready to be amazed. <sighs> There's never any new ones. The play ones are new, usually, but all of these are the same old. Do more magic. Shut up, Tori. All right, Kat. oh, Cat's at our house. Hey, Cat. Using my sewing machine. Cat, how are the costumes coming along? Oh, Tori, I'm ready with Beck's costume, but I'm still working on yours. What's left on mine? Uh, I finally got Beck's red right, but your purple is taking a bit more time. Really? Why is it taking so long? I want the colors to be perfect. If you could bring back his costume, I'll have yours ready by the time you get back. All right, it better be good, Cat. I'm not looking like a buffoon on stage. Okay, we'll come back so you can see us both all Shakespeared out. Beck was at the Asphalt Cafe. I'll see you when you get back. A professional sewing machine used to create our Romeo and Juliet costumes. Okay, I'm about. Blowing up. What's going on? Cooking up a few surprise. Oh, Jade's up to no good. Found a wooden nickel in my hair. I was wondering where that went. Busy with grandma. Meditation retreat. All right. Doing older girl things. <laughs> Shut up, Trina. God, she's so lame. All right, Asphalt Cafe. Give back his costume. Where, wait, where's Beck? Why, don't, why was I gonna click out this woman? Like, that, that was Beck now. Hey guys, I'm looking for Beck. Have you seen him? Nope, we're, we're kind of looking for him too. We found his phone. <gasps> he got kidnapped by shit grandma. Really? I wonder where he went. She's probably sh like saving him from the aliens. Well, he was and the he, elites. But he got some text and said he was meeting Jade for something. Hmm. <laughs> okay, well, give me his phone and I'll return it to him when I see him. Well, I don't know. What if he calls? I know how to answer a phone, Robbie. Or how is he going to call without his phone? Well, he could borrow a phone, so. Touche. True. Here, take the phone. Thanks, guys. I'll tell him you found it for him. Yeah, and tell him to share some of those numbers with me. <laughs> Wait, whoa, whoa. Why, why can I click on that boom box? Can I steal it? Hmm, he's missing. Can I call him? Wait, I can't. What am I? All right, shut up, you guys. I was gonna call Jade to call him, cause I'm assuming he's with her. Wait, meet me in the auditorium, I have a surprise. Last message from Drake. See? There we go. I was gonna call Jade. Oh God, what's Jade doing? What if they're like, just, oh, okay. There's nothing. This is a PG game, guys. No dicks flying about. Oh, hey, Tori. Sorry, but have you seen my phone anywhere? Hmm, we should track that down then. Yeah, why is Tori acting like she doesn't have I've it? I've found my phone. I've only been here in the Whoa. Asphalt Cafe. I don't Stalker? know where I've gotten to. She's gonna take it for herself. Leave me alone. Thanks. <laughs> All right. Here. here, Robbie found it in the Asphalt Cafe. You must have dropped it. Awesome. 
Now, what were you saying? You have a costume for me? Yeah. Put it on, put it on. Get naked right here. I finished your costume. Look. Wow. That's a nice red. Yeah, she worked really hard on it. She's still working on mine at my place, but wants to see us both in our outfits. No problem. I'm helping Jay with something. Could we go later? Could you drop by real quick? You want to ask Jade if she's cool with it? Hey, Jade, what are you working on? Well, after you took the Juliet role from me and then took over the stage manager role, <laughs> I figured I'd do something creative for this show. <laughs> I mean, she's right. So I'm working on some special effects. Uh, so you're not just not sabotaging the play anymore? Like, striking me with lightning or something? You'd have to come to my demonstration to find out. Well, I want to thank you, but I also want to run away. Whatever. Look, I'm sorry, things got kind of crazy. You got crazy. I'm chillaxed. Anyway, I'm just finishing up some touches for the crip scene. Oh, don't act like you didn't do anything wrong, Jade. You are screwing around too. The crip scene? Sounds neat, but uh, Kat wanted Beck and I to head over to show her our costumes. So go. I need some time before my demonstration anyway. Really? Well, that was easy. Beck, Jade says she needs a little time anyway. We can go see Kat right now. Sounds good, I'll meet you at your place. It sounds like it sounds good. Uh, I'm not, I want cheese now. No, I want cheese. Why would he even say that? Come on, Matt. Wait. What, what is that thing? All right. Oh, wow. Looking hot. I'm going to wow, look so that, stupid, that I bet. Costume looks great on you. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. It does. Turn around. Let us see that back. <laughs> All right. Okay, Kat, Beck is ready and looks great. How's my costume coming along? It's ready. Just change into it. <gasps> um, wow, all right. Wow, that looks perfect. Oh, I'm so excited. This is awesome, Kat. Okay, okay. I need you and Beck to wear it around a little. See how he likes it. Okay, I'll check with him. Move around a little bit to make sure it feels right. If you think it fits right, then come back here so I can finish all the last touches. It actually doesn't look bad. Wait, let's get a better look. Let me walk over here. Why can't I walk over here? No, no, don't do that. Well, what do you think? It looks great. How do you like it? I think it's great. So, Kat wants us to wear them around a little bit. That could work. Jade just texted me she's ready for her big demonstration. We could head over there. She's gonna fucking murder me, though. Actually, that sounds great. Let's meet at the uh, auditorium. About to be murdered. <gasps> he just disappeared. What? Aliens. The industrial fog machine can fill a room in less than five seconds. Dude, she's filled it with mustard gas. She's gonna kill us all. You should talk to Jade. Okay, Jade, what do you want Beck and I to do? I've got fog drink for ambiance in the crypt scene. I just need you guys to stand where the front row would be and tell me if the fog is thick enough. All right, Jade, hit it! And let there be darkness. Oh, God. Jade, I, uh... <laughs> <gasps> That's a lot of fog. She even sacrificed see. her boyfriend just What's so she right? could kill us. Oh, She's crazy. Sorry. Oh my. <coughs> what the? We're blue. Jade, oh. Hmm. You're right. I should tone down the blue dye. The blue dye? Yeah, I was going for a night blue shade, but I can work with what I've got. Jade, our costumes are ruined. Cat is going to freak. It's Cat. What will she do? Be less happy? Whoa! Whoa! You just wrecked her costumes! She worked forever on these to get the color right, Jade. We gotta fix this. No, you gotta fix this. Really? Why would we do that? We have to work together, Jade. Come on, Jade. Just help out. I suppose we could dye them again. With what, though? Gee, maybe with dye? Cat should have some red dye. Grab it and bring it back. <gasps> Cat's gonna flip. What about you and Beck? We'll get the machine ready for another test run. Go get the die. Oh, she's gonna do it again. Whatever, Jade, you suck ass. Better be purple you're putting in there to get my costume back to normal. <sighs> Poor cat. Oh no, she's sleeping. Wake up. Hey, cat. Oh, there's a hair dye though. B b b b b b blue. Eek. Oh no. She just gave her a nightmare. Did I wait? What's that? Did I unlock a, um... 
cat might be upset if she saw me right now. Okay. Let's just go. <gasps> Wait, what can we do with that? Anything? Probably not. All right, all right. I have the red hair dye. So we're just gonna put the. All right, we're gonna put the dye in there and then the blow them again. Jade, we're going to need purple as well. Purple, huh? Well, I have red and blue. Yes, red and blue make purple. It's not rocket science. Phew! All right. I thought we <sighs> were in trouble. So, what color should I mix up for you? Purple. Okay, yell at me when you want me to fire this baby up. All right, get out of the way. Hey, Beck. We have to be careful where we stand for the dying process. No problem. Where do you want me to stand? Out of the way. All right. I'm ready. All right. Tell me when to go. Wait. I have to stand in it. Oh. <laughs> God. I thought we were going to walk over there once it started. All right. Uh, well, that didn't do anything. All right. Tell me when to go. All right, I want to move into the fire. I should have read everything. It's just I didn't. All right, I'm ready though. Wait, how do I tell her I'm ready? All right, tell me when okay. to go. That's how it works. So I would have to walk over there again to talk to her. I've never long distance talked to someone on this game. All right, great. And now. All right, tell me when to go. We need red. All right, tell me when to go. And hey, Beck, you. We have to be. No problem. Where stand in the fog area. And me. All right, tell me when to go. I want to move out. And All you. Right, tell me when to go. Go. I'm a little close. A little too close for my liking. All right, the costumes are fixed. Great. Cat will never know. All right, that did it. All right, you better show Cat. I have to adjust my fog recipe. Right, I'll grab Beck and we'll go. Thanks, Jade. Oh man, it's still gonna look. Beck, it probably look looks so bad again. though. We have to get to Cat and tell her we're ready. Not like it did originally. No problem, Tori. I'll meet you there. I hope Cat still notices and freaks out and slaps us, like she finally stops being happy and just mauls our face off. And Beck's too. He's not safe in all this. Oh, Tori, I had a horrible dream. Your dress was the wrong color and I had to remake it. It was horrible. Don't worry, Cat. It was just a dream. Another dimension where we didn't fix this. Well, both Beck and I love our costumes. We wouldn't change a thing. Oh, Tori, that's so great to hear. Thank you both. Yep, we love them. So, now that I'm done, do you have time to help me with my mime practice? Ugh. Here we go. All right, now let me get through the mime practice. All right, that's over. Let's check out the next part. Do a long episode since it's been a while. And then I'll upload the next part like way more soon. Like, that, I let that go too long. I didn't even realize. Oh, wow. Who are these fine young men? Sorry, Tori. I'm pretty busy right now. Oh, okay. Maybe we can catch up later. I'm doing something right now. Andre, how's the music coming along? I'm about finished. I'm just having trouble coming up with the final song. What you got so far? I've got something, but I need some feedback on it. Okay, I'll gather up our friends and we can see what's working. Great. I'll work up a few remixes and see what gets everybody moving. All right, I'll get everyone together. You could probably just text everyone on your pair phone. I really have to make a phone call. Excuse me. Hmm. I'll just text everybody to come to the music room. Hey guys, Andre needs our help in the music room. A-S-A-P. Hmm, Beck, Robbie, and Kat say they're on their way. Trina can't make it. No loss. I'll need to go find Sinjin and Jade. Do I have to find them? Wait, what's this? I'll just steal it. I'm stealing your music. My bad. Don't really care. Jade? Well, I don't think she would still be in the auditorium. Auditorium. Get it? <sighs> no one's here. No one's here but the locker that looks like a dick. 
Where is everyone? God! Ah. Are they all in the auditorium? Maybe they're in acting class. Okay, good. You're both here. What is that? Sinjin, Andre needs Can I help for his big finale song. switch it over? It looks really satisfying. You know, like a big red button? A big switch like I'd that? I'd love to help, but until I get the light set up for a show, I have terrible nerves. Go set them up. I need Jade to finish up with her special effects before I can hook up the switch for the lights. Let me talk to Jade. Jade, what is this? Okay, here's the deal. I need you to finish up your work on the special effects so I can get Sinjin to leave. Ha! No. I think Sinjin is about to turn purple, and that is way cooler than helping you out right now. Jade! Stop bullying Sinjin! Looks like a good old standoff. Do not turn him purple. As much as I would actually technically enjoy that, you can't just bully people even though it... it just don't. You're gonna hurt his feelings. <gasps> don't you dare. Looks like a good old standoff. You should know better than to touch that. I'm gonna touch everything. Hey, hey, Tori. I know you want to help, but that thing has a thousand gigawatts running through it. Here, let me show you how to do it. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, that's what I was gonna do, Sinjin. The fuck Almost do you done. think I was gonna do? Ride it? Yeah, take your time. Wouldn't want you to cross your wires or something. <laughs> you should know better than to touch that. Fuck you, Jade. Why would I take anything from you? <gasps> I'm telling Mr. Psychowitz. Alright, let's go snitch. I bet we can snitch. We always snitch on Jay. We're like, she's ruining everything. Psychowitz, we're listening to Andre's finale song. You want to come along? Sorry, Tori. I have a coconut facial peel scheduled in a few minutes. Oh, okay then. But the music. Sorry, Tori. Fine, don't come. I don't care. You can even snitch. Okay, what, what, what can I do here? Hmm, Beck, Robbie, and Kat say they're all need to go find Sinjin and. Oh, we found. Alright, let's look for things. We obviously need to pick something up. So let's. Maybe the locker area, because there's nothing there. Maybe there is something there. We just can't find it. Boy, walking boy. Have they had walking boys this entire time? Or is that walking boy a new phenomenon? I've never seen it before. I can't get anything here. Nothing in the trash. Can't talk to the normies. All right, art classroom probably has something, maybe. Oh. No. There's nothing. Alright, well, let's see what these guys are doing. Thanks for helping out with the music. Yeah, sure. No problem. Thanks for helping out with the music. Can I play the kazoo? No. Thanks for helping out with the music. No problem. When does the music start? When your girlfriend stops being a little bitch. Can you go control her? Andre, are we ready to start? Not yet. We still need everyone gathered. You don't need everyone. Go track them down for me. You don't need everyone. I tracked them down. They're being difficult. It's not Maybe my fault. Maybe we can catch up later. I'm doing something right now. I don't even know you. I don't even know you. So don't talk to me like that. Like we're going to catch up later. Almost done. Oh, yeah. Take your time. What? Can you, like, just so, turn him purple? where'd the little freak go? Oh, my God. All right, he's at the lever. Oh, good. For a second, I thought he left. Where's Sinjin? I'm missing his little panic attack because of you. He left for the music room. What the heck? She's so evil. Trying to force a panic attack on Sinjin? That's not funny, Jade. That's not funny at all to make fun of someone's anxiety. Sinjin left? 
I didn't see him leave. Uh, yeah. He said bye and everything. You must be really focused on your special effects. He was just about to turn purple, and now I am missing it because you went and messed with his stuff. Fine, let's go help Andre. I'm ruining all of my fun. Yep, right behind you. No. Okay. Jade's gone. Really? Wow, I didn't think she was ever gonna leave. Yeah, just chalk up another success for the Torinator. Really? Torinator. Just doesn't work. What about something like victorious? Ah uh ha -huh, ha! I see what you did there. Fine, whatever. Just go to the music room. <gasps> Wait, what can I do with that? Oh, I can't do anything with it. I thought I could sabotage her fog machine also. Man, I wish Andre's grandma made an appearance. <gasps> you know, I think you can actually wait before I, we actually do this. I think um, she's actually an Easter egg in Psycho Witch's classroom. Maybe. Watch. Watch right here. Should grandma should come up. She should. I'm totally not making this up. It might have just, maybe it was just the, um, one where, uh, she was actually a character. Alright, maybe not. Alright, I lied. Oh my god. Maybe if you wait, maybe if you wait long enough she shows up. All right, let's get this music on the road. Like, let's go. Andre, I'm done with this. Everyone's here. Let's hear it. Okay, I've made some adjustments. Each band member will play one of the three types of music. I thought he was about to be like, actually, I need these people here and these. I was like, no. Talk to each one and decide on the type of music, and then we can get started. No, that's your job, Andre. I'm not in charge of music. So I talk to each band member, then talk to you. Can you? That's it. We need to get everybody dancing. So let's see what works. Seriously. Thanks for helping out with the music. I'm stealing yeah, everyone's yeah. job. No Tori, you really need to nail the finale before we head out. Okay, uh, I'm Thanks trying to click out with the music. Can I play the kazoo? Thanks for helping out with the- Don't forget your- Come on, Tori. What do I want with- Thanks for helping out with the music. Any idea why Sinjin wasn't here when I got here? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, shut up, Jade. Thanks for helping out with the. No problem. When is? All right, they yeah, should all be dancing. Play plucky or power chords or solo guitar style. Play plucky. No problem. Plucky guitar, it is. I can play energetic. Jazzy or orchestral keyboard. Jazzy. Jazzy keyboards. Come. I can play acoustic, electric, or world drums. World drums. Some world beat w drums world. coming at you. All right. Okay, I think they're all set. Are you sure? We need to get everyone dancing. All right, boys, hit it. Oh yeah. Sounds good. Great. Those two aren't dancing. All right, well, these, they are, so at least one thing is right. What do you think, Andre? Not everyone seems to... Oh, man, I thought... I thought so, too. All right, what did you like, Cat? Or didn't you like... wrong? What? Ugh, these keyboards make my teeth itch. All right, keyboard's bad. I'm so sorry, I don't have time for you. <gasps> I'm trying to tell you what the fuck to do. Sinjin, do you know... The guitar just... All right, the guitar is the issue. Now, what do you like? Yeah, this is awesome. I think it's the, they like the drums. Let's talk later. All right, we can kill them. Are you sure? All right. All right, you. Energetic, jazzy, or, this. or, all right, orchestral keyboard. You. Yeah, man, I can play plucky, or power chords, or solo. Solo. Sweet guitar. All right, let's try All now. All right, Andre. Um, no. So, no. I'm afraid. Okay, I have to. She I already had instructions. Electric or world drums? World drums. Some world. Didn't tell you to change. Okay, I think they're. Are you sure? All right, bull. Yeah, yes, I got it. Oh, yeah, this is lit. The dancing's embarrassing. They need to start, like. They need a dancing class at the school, obviously, because this is like embarrassing. This has got to be a hit, right? This is great. 
We're ready for the finale now. Great! I'll check music off the list. Are you sure? Is it all right? Yay, guys! All right, thank you. Wait, I'll give you guys a preview to the next chapter after I get through this boring part. That's probably good. Maybe it won't repeat. If it doesn't repeat, I'll show you it. If it's just a repeat of all the uh, gameplay parts we've seen so far, then I'll skip it. Pick this up. No, it's just Andre and it's a guitar. We have seen this a million right. times. All right, let's see the next episode. All right, all right, Andre, you've had your spotlight. Let's go. Let's move along. He's good. Unless there's, sometimes there's not a cutscene, but hopefully there's a cutscene that we can see right now. It's a little sneak peek. Oh, there's not. Or right, well, let's just talk to someone. It looks like it's gonna be about Sinjin and his lighting. All right, nothing's out. There we go. Sinjin asked me to be here for the fun. All right, Sinjin. I I think I have everything. Okay. Yep. All right. Let's see what happens. What is Sinjin doing? Calm down, guy. Uh, oh. That was not really what I was expecting. Oh no, the fog ma- What just happened? Yes, Sinjin, what just happened? Oh, you're in trouble. I don't know, my After wiring the paint is right. too. You're gonna get Someone expelled. must have sabotaged the lighting rig. Sabotage? Jade, oh, what do you know about that? Whoa. Don't look at me, those are my effects that got ruined. I don't think it was Jade. She's been working hard on those effects. Uh, you know, she's been against the play from the start. If you can prove that Jade is innocent, I'll listen. But until then, she's guilty. Hey, that's fine with me. I have no issue with that one. <laughs> Bye, Jade. See you later. 